Hello. 안녕하세요. So today we will try to learn go to some place in Korean. So we will try to learn vocabularies about places and we will try to learn how we can say to go to. Okay, cool. So let's go. So let's see here. Um, so we will try to learn places, vocabularies, and we will try to learn how we can say to go to. And how we can say to go to, so that would be a car, place, a car. Let's repeat, place, a car. Cool, brilliant. And we will try to see some examples. So let's see first one. We will try to say house in Korean. It says 집. 집. That's for pronunciation and that's writing in Korean. 집. 집. Cool. And now if I want to say I go to house or I go to home, that would be 집. A. Kyle. Cheap a Kyle. Cool. Really good. Let's go first. Cool. Ha go. Ha go. Really good. If I want to say I go to school, that would be ha go. A Kyle. Hakyo A Kyle. Hakyo A Kyle. Really good. The next one would be library. So let's say To So Kwan. To So Kwan. If you want to say I go to library, that would be cool. 도서관 에 가요. 도서관 에 가요. Really good. Let's go for hospital. 병원. 병원. Cool. If I want to say I go to hospital, be Pyongwon A Kyle Pyongwon A Kyle Pyongwon A Kyle Cool And let's go for pharmacy That would be Ya Ku Ya Ku Ya Ku A Kyle Yakuge Kyle and police Kyung Char So that would be police office. So police office Kyung Char So Kyung Char So Kyung Char So E Kyle and fire station So Pang so So Pang So So Pang So E Kyle So Pang So E Kyle So Pang So E Kyle Cool Market Si Chang Si Chang Si Chang E Kyle 시장에 가요. 시장에 가요. Cool. And let's go for hairdressers. 미용실. 미용실. 미용실에 가요. 미용실에 가요. 미용실에 가요. Cool. You're doing really good. And post office. U Che Ku. U Che Ku. 
우체국에 가요. 우체국에 가요. 우체국에 가요. Cool. Restaurant. 식당. 식당. 식당에 가요. 식당에 가요. 식당에 가요. And department store. 백화점. 백화점. I go to the department store. 백화점에 가요. 백화점에 가요. 백화점에 가요. And cinema. 영화관. 영화관. I go to cinema. 영화관에 가요. 영화관에 가요. 영화관에 가요. And petrol station. 주유소. 주유소. 주유소에 가요. 주유소에 가요. 주유소에 가요. Cool. Really good. You did really good job today. You can go back to the start of the video to review and you can try to remember how you can use a kyo which is to go to that expression is really really important and really really common and really really useful so i hope you can try to use in korea or you can try to use when you talk with korean okay thanks for watching this video today and we'll see you next time thank you bye bye Annyeong.